Uh, hello and welcome to One Minor Niners. This is a Minecraft R Ultra Hardcore recorded round. What? Uh, oh, that was awesome. Christmas is ruined. Um, <laughs> this is the first recorded round on the subreddit, as far as I know, to be played in the 1.9 snapshots. Uh, we're using version 15W47C. Uh, this season will be five 20 minute episodes plus a meetup. The map is 3000 by 3000 blocks and uh, PvP is enabled episode 2. Um, some other things. Nether's on, but we can't disable potions in vanilla, really. So we're just doing gentleman's rule and not allowing strength to. Um, no trapping or camping. Uh, which also applies to the end, which is where we're going to be having a meetup uh, segue. Meetup uh, is going to be called after the 100 minutes or whatever, and there's a portal down at the bottom of 00, zero that you can't really see. Um, beginning of episode 6, yes, thanks, Green. Um, it's going to be lit then, and then you can go in and fight it out in the end. Uh, if you find someone in the overworld, like at zero zero or somewhere else, at before meetup or during, you can fight them. But uh, you have to be in the end at the very end. <laughs> um, absorptions on, heads are off because they don't exist. Uh, absorptions enabled. Horses do not use horses because they're very glitchy, and if you stay on them, you'll it's not convenient. Um, You'll die. What else? Also, if you haven't already done so, put your attack indicator onto a hot bar or crosshair, so that way you can know when to click. And um, about our scatter, you might notice we all have these wings on us. Uh, we're all gonna be flying away for a minute from up here, way up high, and. Uh, after that minute, they're all gonna be gone, all the gliders. So, I think that's it, um, from me. Um. And now Davin, Mr. Hey. Raven, for the, the player introduction. Alright, hello, hello, hello everyone. Um, so, uh, I'll just start introducing the players. We got the Cappy Rappy, um, GG Cappy Rappy is here, we lost. Um, we got Jingle Bell Texel, uh, nice name, nice name, nice name. Don't say the N-word. Uh, Sugar Bell ZZ, uh, the Men with Legend, uh, Sugar Bell's card, shut up. Uh, Fukano, hello, hello, welcome to RR. Uh, we have Andrizzle PC, the Red Spy, and his Santa skin and everything. Um, we have Majora, a little, a little bit of an odd one out here, I'm, I'm just saying, you didn't get the, uh, the memo, man. We got all the Santa skins, and you're just, uh, yeah. Alright, yeah, hello, Majora. Uh, Blues Maker, uh, the Grinch here, is, uh, yeah, he kind of got the memo, kind of, yeah. Uh, we got Ben G-Man, uh, he's new, he hasn't played any uh, Reddit RRs, and uh, yeah, welcome him to the crew. Uh, we have Gren, uh, the, the Gren man. Oh, you're not looking at me, okay. So, uh, welcome Gren. Uh, Saint Brickless, aka Shut Up Brick, uh, Spanison and all. Um, yeah, yeah, hello, hello. Uh, there's Kurt, hello, welcome to, the, to Minecraft, and um, yep, that's it, okay, cool. So... <laughs> uh, yeah. yeah, I guess without further ado, we'll start one niner miners. And I wasn't recording. And neither was Tommy, I guess. And off we fly. <laughs> and I decided to go fly into the sunset with this beautiful Elytra. Ooh, yeah! Are we are we making some good distance? Let's 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 see how far we can go here. Oh, uh, things are loading uh, slowly. I see extreme hills over there, but I like I like this nice swamp. Am 
Might make uh, getting apples easier. Actually, I think I want to uh, start off in the swampy area. Because, heck, I want apples. I like apples. Woo! All right. <laughs> so we're, I'm at only 500 blocks away, and I bet, I bet, uh, don't know if, uh, I'm not used to a uh, texture pack, <laughs> or the lack thereof, rather. Where I think I'm, I'm ready. Okay, well, welcome to One Niner Miners: The Reprise. This is the second, actually, recording of One Niner Miners. The other one was during Halloween, and now, obviously, you can tell by my Grinch skin, this one is is for another occasion. Let me take these reeds right over here before I forget. Uh, and let me grab a little bit more wood. I'd be more comfortable with a little bit more wood. Um, so uh, this is a 1.9, well, not quite 1.9 actually, it's a snapshot recorded around. So we're in a snapshot right now. And a lot of things have changed. And um, uh, w some of those changes is is one of the reasons why we uh, were forced to uh, make a, a, new, a new go at this. It's very new territory, and um, some of the elements... Oh, great. <laughs> some of the elements of... Uh, what am I saying? Of 1.9 are not really uh, in vanilla at least, vanilla 1.9 are not really made for UHC. It's not a it's not an easy I think I think uh, yeah. Jeez. Trying, trying to make simple tools and make simple explanations at the same time apparently is too much to ask out of me. Um, but yeah, it's a little it's a little wonky. So what are the differences? There are a lot of differences. Uh, the main one is the addition of the shields, and you'll see me craft a shield as soon as I can, because it has become the probably... Oh, okay, I'm hearing zombies already, and bats. So I know there's a cave there, but I don't have leather, so I'm not in a hurry to go in there. Uh, I need a shovel, and I also need sword and I I like since it's vanilla and um, the sat saturation is not fixed at all I like to have an early furnace to cook food especially if I need to explore a little bit okay so I got got one apple that pleases me we're gonna cut down a few more trees then we're gonna chop uh, chop some mutton get some food going Oh, yeah, yeah, well, in terms of the other things that have changed, that was one of them. <laughs> you noticed, um, you can't, you can't click spam. Here you go. You have, there's a charge time before you can, you can click stuff. Oh, chickens, beautiful. I should go, kill, I go should go kill them. There's like a charge time. When you attack, that changes uh, melee significantly, let's just say that way. Alright, and let me... What? Okay, there you go. I hear lava beneath me. Come on. Oh, really? Okay. Wow, okay, th I'm... <laughs> I'm having a, a, a more difficult time at this than I did in the first time around. But as you as you can tell, that changes not just the PvP, but it will also eventually change. It will affect the PvE. 
And the PvE uh, is also changed a lot because... Uh, uh, how, how to put this? How do, how do I say this in a way that is gentle? The skeletons are the main issue. With the way uh, PvP... Uh, not PvP, but I mean PvE has changed. Uh, it's like a return to the... Oh, I need, I need that cow over there. It's like a return to uh, the 1.5, Minecraft 1.5 skeletons, if you will. Like, these guys strafe like like they're CSGO players. I mean, they are for real. Okay. Uh, just with the charge thing. Uh, oh, man. You're making, you're making this so difficult on me. So... I'm not good, as you can see, with the charging thingy. Um, so, unfortunately, there are several players in this game where I normally would have tried to rely, or not rely, but I've, I would have preferred uh, melee as a more even playing field, if you will, against them, because they're so much better at the bow than I am, that uh, if if the attack is uh, done with melee, then, then, like... I sort of have a, a decent chance. Not not the case anymore. I don't know that they'd be much better than I am, but uh, the melee battles are going to be... They're just going to be funky. Are you... Okay. Hey, Green. So Green's with me. That's a lot of fun times. <laughs> Hopefully he won't follow me too long. But I got four apples out of the deal, so I got I got what I wanted most out of the swamp. I think I would ultimately need more than four, but uh Yeah, beetroot uh, is one of the Vegetables. And uh, it's either a really, really bad uh, source of food, like uncooked potatoes, and you can't cook them, or you can um, have them be... Come on, Green, are you really going to be following me this closely the whole time? Um, too many creepers. Um, so what I was saying with the PVE is I need blocks on my bar. That's what I was saying. No, seriously, uh, I, I almost went into this cave and I didn't have blocks on my bar. Um, the thing is, is since you can't swing very fast, you can't uh, charge mobs the same way as you used to. And uh, that changes uh, things so significantly in a huge fashion uh, for the PvE that uh, walling up is almost always the best, better solution because of, yeah <laughs> because you can't charge anymore you, like you can't rush a skeleton and kill it before it shoots uh, because you have to wait to wind up so and it's it strafes like mad so it no longer just uh, you know, it's no longer as easy a target as it once was uh, so, so, like, I'll get to other changes, obviously, as they, as they come up, I guess, because, obviously, I'm, I'm trying to look for stuff. I actually, technically, have pretty much most of the things I need. Um, I think we probably have a gentleman's agreement not to build, uh, bookshelves. Uh, but if I did find more cows, I would not be against that. But I guess, I guess I won't be finding more cows. Um, what I do want is, uh, I'd like, uh, I was looking for that little cave there. Because what I do want is a shield. And I want a shield before uh, night falls. And especially now that it's raining. Mm, beautiful rain. 
normally uh, rain would be pretty much off in my settings. Oh, wait, I can actually do this, right? Uh, options, video settings, uh, particles decreased. Is that done? Would that do? No, that's not. That's not the same. That's not those particles. Oh. Uh. Well, whatever. I don't know where they change it, and I don't want to. I don't want to look at that screen forever. The rain, at, as it stands, does not does not change anything. Um, I wasn't paying attention, but uh, I think um, we uh, will have to. Oh, someone's someone started it here. Everyone shift. Uh, yeah, I did full circle over here. Uh, I think I'm going to be returning to the swamp. I did not find the things I liked. Woo. Uh, but yeah, uh, PVE-wise, it's going to be serious business. Trust me. Now, I did pretty well... Oh, no, night is falling. I did pretty well... In fending for myself, uh, in the last go rounds, like it, I, I wasn't Iron Man, but you don't need to be Iron Man to fare pretty well PVE wise. Um, but I, I did pretty pretty well with the PVE. Uh, the main issue, but I did I did get a shield earlier than this, and night is a falling. I don't like that. I don't like that. What I'm gonna do is, uh, I'm actually I'm gonna look at my trees, see if I can't pick up um, uh, another apple on the quick the trees. I removed. Doesn't look like it. And now mobs are spawning. All right, I apologize for the darkness. I think I'm going to be able to craft a torch for now. Um, I'll also get a thing, but normally I have a texture pack that has a semi-bright. I can't have the... My texture packs are not compatible with the snapshots at, as it stands. So I'm going to make sure I have uh, plenty of coal to cook in all because I'm going to have to f cook iron as soon as I can. Craft, uh, the ver at the very least, a shield. Now, I know there's a cave here, of course. We heard it last time. When I staircased here. Oh, and yes, it is my pleasure to immediately find some iron. That is good. Because I do want... I do want that shield ASAP. Let me start start the cooking right away. There you go. I hope um, people will be classy enough to not attack immediately on day two. I think that'd be a little bit... It's all, I always find that to be... Like a, 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 a not very gentlemanly move. Uh, it's completely within the rules. And it's not, it's not bad or anything. It's just like... Yeah. <laughs> it's, I don't find it gentlemanly. Um, okay, so let's craft the shield, if I remember correctly. I craft it like this. Yes, okay. So here we go with one of the other changes, is the dual wielding. Now I'm going to put the dual wield with a shield for the entire time. I know it's going to block a lot of the view. But given, if I want to survive some good PvE, I need to be able to, like, block like this at a moment's notice. The faster I'm able to block, the better. Uh, so the next things I build are, tend to be the bucket... And, uh, a nice, a nice pick. There you go. And then we proceed to armor. Now, uh, one of the things that we discovered the hard way in the, uh, in the first attempt of recording this is that in order to make the shield more, more worthwhile, um, Mojang decreased the efficiency of armor. So that even if you have, like, full iron, it, it doesn't block as much damage as it once did. 
right? So uh, that that's gonna be that's gonna sting a little bit. It's gonna be a thing. And uh, oh, Cappy Rappy, what have you done, Majora? What are you doing? What is going on? Um. Oh, I'm trying to. Oh, okay. Uh, again, very important, but I need blocks on my bar. And I'm a little high here. I don't like don't like the view I'm given. Especially given the fact that there's a baby zombie. Like, imagine if a baby zombie came in here. Come on now. Okay, well, I got one. <laughs> now, you saw I switched to the axe. Uh, the axe can hit too, it hits with more damage as well. Uh, but the recharge is slower. I okay, got more iron over there. And, uh, yeah. Caving, suddenly, a lot trickier than it once was. Ah. Okay, I don't know how to go, uh, how to go in, but I will have to make the attempt sooner than later. Um, how many... Okay, I can make pants. Should I make pants or something else? I'm gonna make pants. Okay. Let's take our gear and move on. Move forward. Ah, <laughs> uh, come on. All right. I like how, how like, timid I suddenly am. And I wasn't that timid uh, last time. I wasn't, like, that, how do I say, scared of mining last time. Uh, the, the thing is, it's sometimes it's the layout of the cave, right? If you don't see, like, the, as much as you'd like on the other corner or something, if you don't have the field of vision you want... Then suddenly, you know, you're a lot more guarded about what, what step you take next. Alright. The idea... Oh, although I like the sound of water. Because I like the sound of having water in my bucket. I'm going to move along. Uh, the cave... This cave is looking like it's going to give me full iron at the very least, but... That's not, that's not exactly what, what we want. We want a little, okay, okay, oh, okay. All right, I see how it is. Mm-hmm. I see gold down there, so I'm going to pick that up. And what the heck is happening to me? I can't see anything. Okay. <laughs> Apparently there's a, a deeper layer to this cave. Yeah, there is. Okay. Um, I'm going to start smelting some iron immediately. Uh, because the faster I can get some full armor, the better in my opinion. So I'm just going to keep uh, smelting as much stuff as I can on the go, on the fly. And uh, we have a cave. Okay, let's light this room. Here, I like this room here. Feels safe and secure. And I think we can put a second... Uh, a second... Uh, a fernicle. And get the stuff of our... The rest of our stuff smelting. But, yeah. Um, I'm taking this... Like, like the idea... The idea here is to like basically learn what what 
uh, like 1.9 recorded rounds could end up looking like. I think, like, based on the snipe snapshots so far, and keep in mind, we're still in snapshots, so a lot of things could change in future, but the uh, Mojang is leaving things, uh, a lot of things, so that they're customizable. So I think if people think the uh, armor, uh, for example, is has gotten too weak, I think we're going to have the uh, options, the hosts, to change and tweak the value uh, of armor, or how much how much it does or does not protect, how much it uh, absorbs or not, you know, that all that kind of stuff. So I think there's going to be a lot of room for customization, but here we're testing out the vanilla settings. What does it look in vanilla, right? Uh -huh. And what does this cave look like? Uh, where am I? Okay, look, 18. I heard lava over there. I know I forgot, uh... I know I forgot, uh, I didn't forget the furnacle that's way over there. 